Hey, everybody. Hey, friends. <laughs> so we just got to Mammoth, and uh, we're on the shuttle. We're going to go up to, um, I guess it's the, uh, it's the Mammoth uh, Ski Lodge area. Buy the tickets for the Devil's Post Mile uh, shuttle. Take the shuttle down and catch the John Muir. And we're going to go to Yosemite. We're excited. Very excited. Ah, good afternoon. We are now on the John Muir Trail. Just climbed up a semi-steep section. It's pretty hot. And she came. She came and it's hot. <laughs> she came. Um, yeah, yeah, so uh, the plan is to head to Yosemite Valley. Um, we'll see if we make it, if we bail out at Tuolumne, I don't know. We're just enjoying the trail. We've obviously done this before, about three years ago. And it's one of our favorite trips, so came back up. Decided to get to do it again, and here we go. First water crossing. It's not too bad. Oh, that's not too bad. It's lower than I expected. That's where the bridge used to be. It used to run through there. But it wiped out. Wiped out by too much snow. So we're making our way up this incline here, up to, uh, I think the first lake will be Trinity Lake, or lakes on the right-hand side. Uh, but a nice, pretty nice grade for about two miles here. And it's nice and shaded. Temperature's great, it's probably about 75. And uh, yeah, looking forward to getting a drink once we're there. Coming into Trinity Lake, and it is beautiful just as I remember it last time. I think we were here three or four years ago. Oh, great. Oh yeah? Oh yeah. Ah, oh, he's really cute. Alright, so we filled up at Trinity Lake, and now we're on to the next lake. 
I think the next one is Vivian, if I'm not mistaken. And then uh, a couple small lakes, then I believe it's Rosalie. Gladys and then Rosalie. Coming into Gladys Lake. Oh, look at that. Very nice. So quiet. So we're making our descent down to Rosalie Lake, one of our favorite lakes. Uh, a few years ago when we did this trail, it's where we camped out our first night. And I just remember how exhausted we were getting there. We left post pile early and then we got here really late. I think it just, we just weren't in backpacking shape and uh, it took us forever to get here. And then we finally camped and we were wiped out, but we loved the lake itself. So we're just uh, coming down on it to beautiful, Rosalie Lake. Oh my gosh, Rosalie. Whoa. This is really pretty too. Whoa. <laughs> Almost went down. That was where that tent is up there. That's where we camped when we were here. Coming into Shadow Lake.
Well, we just found our spot for the night. We hiked about 10 miles and uh, we're at the junction to, um, where are we at? We're, we're at the junction that goes up to Garnet Lake. So tomorrow morning we'll have a climb up over this pass that's behind me here, over that way, or sorry, in front of me. Um, and we're right along the river here. Minarets are over this way. Um, it's just after six, so we figured we had enough. <laughs> we're gonna camp out. Um, mosquitoes are pretty bad. Um, the deep really isn't keeping them at bay too much. But uh, yeah, we got a good spot. We have tons of food. And uh, yeah, gonna have a good night. So we've just set up camp. And right now I'm exploring because uh, there's some really nice light coming over the minarets and I want to see if I can get it. So I can climb up these rocks. These bad boys. This is our site down here. And in the background, the minarets. Lots of snow still, tons of snow. Let's see if I can zoom in. Today's August 24th, 2019. Tons of snow, more people camping out. Back over here. And then that is, that's Shadow Lake. We've done about, uh, I think we've done about 10 miles today. Maybe nine and a half. And uh, tomorrow the plan is to go up, up over that pass over there because that leads over to Garnett along the John Muir Trail. And I don't know where we're gonna camp tomorrow. I, I think we're just gonna go and see how far we can get. If we go over Donahue, I think that's, that's a good day, which I think we will, because uh, we're pretty strong hikers. Time for dinner. Quick look around the campsite. So the tent, obviously. And oh, plain Sudoku. <laughs> uh, tonight, we brought some wine, some black box Chardonnay. This is really nice. Tomorrow, I actually brought a can of Pinot Noir uh, from Dark Horse. Um, so that should be nice. Of course, we got the sunblock and also the 100% DEET. Uh, the camera as well. In case you're wondering what I shoot with, I shoot with a Sony A6500, and this is my go-to lens. It's a 18 to 105, and then of course I use a Rode. Uh, it's called a Video Micro with the wind muff to get that nice buttery audio. Yeah, so that's what I use to shoot with. Shoot. Oops, this tripod's getting kind of bad. It's a Joby though. It should should last for a while. Um, yeah, so I use that. Um, shooting 4K. Also brought a ton of food. <laughs> this thing is packed. Um, we have Mexican style rice and chicken, Southwest style mesa with beef. In my bag, I have a black bart chili and then in that one, I think there's like another chicken dish. So there's a ton of food. Um, of course we got tea, um, beef jerky, Gosh, you name it, we got it. I mean, we're not gonna starve out here. There's everything in here. Everything. We need to actually start eating this stuff because uh, we need to make room for the trash. But uh, yeah. Yeah, and there's the minarets in the background. Got my jacket opened up because it's been like a month since I've opened that thing up. And uh, having a good time. So a few of you may know where this is. We're right at the junction for Garnet Lake. We're just right up over here. And right now I'm gonna go refill these bottles. Um, a few people have asked me what type of filter we use. And it's just a Sawyer. It just hooks onto the top of like a Smart Water or where are these? Essentia, fancy. We don't drink this stuff. We just drink tap water, to be honest. We just filter it through a Brita, but uh, we needed some new bottles. So these were on sale for a dollar at um, Trader Joe's. So for a dollar for a liter, let's do it. Let's do it. And here's the water. 
we were going to camp right here, but uh, there were too many me, too many mosquitoes. So, look how beautiful it is, though. Wow. Oh my gosh, such a nice spot. I think the horses, horses must go right through here. Over to that side. But look at this. Oh my God. Yeah, get some fresh, fresh mountain water. Ah, oh, love backpacking. So tonight's dinner is black bart chili and a fettuccine alfredo with chicken. Here on the mountainside, and you can see the mosquitoes. You can see them around my face. You can. They're everywhere. It's like a swarm of them. Yeah. So I got my black bean chili here. And, oh, it looks so good. And it is good. And what do you have? I have, um, Chicken Alfredo. Let's see. How's it look? It doesn't look very appetizing, but it <laughs> tastes good. Yeah. I believe it. These are um, legitimate meals out in the backcountry. Got my protein right here, about 50 grams.